Hello and welcome to another exciting permanent ankle shackling vlog. As you can see written on my left sole, I've been permanently shackled for 41 consecutive days. Um, if you don't know what this project is about, I'm a filmmaker who is going to make a movie about a prisoner who's kept barefoot, permanently shackled, and imprisoned in a cell forever. I wanted to know what it's like to be shackled. But in the process of doing this project, I was contacted by a uh, prisoner, a current prisoner in a contracted prison called Facility 5, which I've now been invited to join. So I will be imprisoned um, for an indefinite period of time. This is set by a third party, which, I've, which I have to choose. And uh, I will be imprisoned there. I'm going to be doing a web series there uh, showing my life as a prisoner at that facility as well as interviewing other prisoners at that uh, prison. So in effect, um, my shackling project now is about preparing for permanent ankle shackling at that prison. Um, I'm currently under a very aggressive contract which uh, requires me to remain shackled and barefoot for uh, 100 consecutive days. So I have 59 minimum days to go. Um, if I break any of the requirements of this contract, my uh, shackling will be uh, extended. And by extended, and the word uh, aggressive is an understatement. Um, I can be, my shackling can be increased uh, by 30 days. So a minimum 130 days if I break any, even the smallest rule. Um, if I break a larger uh, requirement, then I could be shackled for multiple years. So um, it's a pretty aggressive contract, and I I cannot afford to break it, to be honest. So I have to be shackled for 100 days minimum, and I cannot break any of the rules, or uh, they're going to be on me forever. As far as my imprisonment, um, I am waiting for a cell to come available. Um, they have what's what they term uh, long-term imprisonment cells, and those cells are all occupied. This prison actually has a waiting list. They bumped me up the waiting list to get me in earlier so that I can do this uh, web series, um, but I still have to wait for a cell to come available, and uh, once one comes available, they'll put me in it. So um, I hope you like this new video format. Um, I wasn't liking the uh, iPad setup because the, the color balance was changing. It just it was really annoying me from video to video. There was so much fluctuation. Even though I tried to lock it in, it still wasn't working for me. So right now you're actually watching a video from a GoPro. Um, it's set up in ProTune. It gives me a lot more control over white balance and, and ISO and all that fun stuff. And also I can monitor it real time from my iPad so I can make sure that my feet are in frame. There are some videos, if you've noticed, that my toes get cut off and it really annoys me. So this way I can monitor it. I have a lot more control over the lights, so the videos will be consistent um, from day to day. And like I said, I have 59 more of these to go, and I want them to look decent, so uh, we're going to go with this for now. Speaking of videos, I posted two new videos. Um, the, you'll see them before this one, uh, so if you haven't seen them, go back. Um, I posted a uh, time lapse of uh, my sleeping in ankle shackles on bare ankles. Um, I'm going to be doing that every... 10 days. So that was on the 40th day. On the 50th day, you'll see another time-lapse video. Um, I also posted an, another video showing how I change out of my uniform for showers and things like that. And there was a, a wardrobe malfunction on that one. Uh, I thought the long shirt that's supposed to be, you know, covering down to my knees was uh, adequate and uh, it wasn't. So I had to blur some things out there. Uh, there was some manhood that's kind of uh, uh, peaked out there. Uh, so just be aware. There's no nudity, but that's why there's a blurring spot between my legs on that video. So uh, anyway, embarrassing. I didn't really want to shoot it over again because I'd have to redress and everything. So it is what it is. Um, but anyway, I um, want to thank the new uh, subscribers. I've had a lot of new subscribers lately, and I appreciate that. It makes me 
happy that I'm doing this, uh, that there's other people interested in it. So be sure to uh, like, comment, share, and keep subscribing. I appreciate it, and I will see you tomorrow for day 42. Thanks for watching.